your troubles are not limited to vocal. All S's turn to sh and all sh turns to gibberish. <laughs> but gibberish is fun. Uh, streaming announcements. Uh, bah. Bah humbug. Everyone, hey all, we are starting up Titan's Clash. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Let's get into the beefy town. All right, ladies and gentlemen, okay. welcome to another episode of Titans Clash. I believe this is the ninth episode, and today we are going to be continuing out from where we were before. You guys have your entire party with you now, as you guys can see down below. Uh, is kind of shocking to me honestly that the entire party is together because usually there's at least one person that disappears but we do in fact have the entire party here hey 5d20 oh things we need nice okay <laughs> but uh so we have with us winchester jap taxi rogue krampus sasaka and ace hi guys hey there Did somebody say Jack? Fuck was that noise? Okay, so uh, oh, yeah. no idea. You guys, uh, last we checked, all right. So let me explain a little bit of what has happened for Rogue and what Rogue has been doing as well. So Rogue, you guys were originally inside of Death Fall here, which I will move out here. Boop. So you guys were originally inside of Death Fall with uh, Old Ham's Grocery Outlet uh, Factory over here. You guys had a Super Mutant. There was Jimmy the Heavy over here. Uh, Vixen's character uh, and Zero's character, the Wanderer, uh, had to more or less be removed. And Vixen got uh, pretty much stepped near explosive, slammed her head against the trunk of a car, uh, went into a coma, uh, Wanderer ran off with her to find the nearest doctor. Oop. Who was that? Oh, that was Rogue. <laughs> Hello, can you hear me? Do not pay attention to that. I've been here the whole time. <laughs> sure. Okay, uh, but yeah, so uh, Vixen's character went to a coma. Uh, Wander uh, grabbed her and went to the nearest doctor inside of a car, which was almost certainly the doctor you guys had met before inside of, I believe, Bay Death Standing, I think. Hold on. Quests, uh, Q Crusaders, uh, yes, yeah, somewhere near Death Standing. The, uh, the doctor that gave you, uh, Nadia. And then you guys met, uh, Sasaka and Ace. Uh, Sasaka is a tiny little two foot ten midget who managed to scare a ten foot tall ish super mutant. Uh, well, intimidate him into talking with her. And Ace is a gunslinger who is terrified of 90% Regret all of his life decisions. Yeah, he's regretting like 90% of things that brought him to this point cuz uh, he, he just keeps meeting super mutants, death claws and and death. <laughs> um and then and it's all because of Sasuke. <laughs> yeah. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> And uh, Jap Taxi went uh -huh. up and started talking to Jimmy the Heavy, who beat the living crap out of Cruise Crusader. At this point in time, Winchester attempted to get them to stop talking, in which Krampus came by, who basically oh. is a gigantic super mutant who had enough strength to literally step on this car and flatten it under his foot without paying attention. And he ran through this gate. Uh, literally impaled Jimmy the Heavy on his axe and then took the car and started flattening Jimmy the Heavy uh, before crumpling the car up like used paper and tossing it hard enough into this nuclear bomb to indent itself inside of there and start leaking radiation. Um, and then... Grant, uh, Winchester then grabbed the body of Jimmy the Heavy, so you guys can turn that in. And around this time, uh, stuff went going down, so Krampus eventually took you guys all the way up, with a lot of running, to Burnout up here. Which is quite a distance, but you guys traveled quite a while. You guys got up to Burnout, in which you guys then met, uh, here we are. Uh, the big buddy boo right here, who is a super mutant gargantuan named, uh, 
What's his name again? Uh, Remus. Yes, Remus. Remus then told you guys that basically there was a massive war going on between the Super Mutants, the Brotherhood of Steel, and the Enclave, which I've now pro uh, proactively, retroactively, retroactively, retroactively changed. Retroactively. Uh, yeah, retroactively changed. So now the Brotherhood of Steel are the Americans because I like to have that theme around just because I can. And then the Enclave are the ones who basically say if you're not pure, you will die. They're, they're the purists. Uh, they hate radiation and all that fun stuff and don't like pretty much any of you. So there we go. And uh, y'all made kind of friends with him. Uh, he told you guys that basically you need to either destroy the other two groups with them uh stop the war from happening in its, in its entirety by talking to the group, two groups or you guys could just fuck off and watch although that may result in the two groups heading down uh south and destroying everything in their path as most wars are opt to do uh also they require uh remus specifically requested that you guys get a chemical uh used in order to make it so super mutants uh don't have infinite lifespans effectively without being shot through the head uh because he and his group of super mutants here which, as he stated, did not at all pertain to anyone outside of his group, but only those who followed him, uh, wish to die. And they kind of can't, unless it's a very explosive or very painful death. And he wants to die peacefully, preferably in their sleep, like humans get to. And it's kind of a sore spot for him. And that's very much where you guys are at the moment. You guys are heading down to... Vault 300, which I decided to name 300 because I could. I actually don't know most of the vault names. I'm fairly certain 300 isn't a name, which for it works perfectly for me. Uh, in order to find out more... Huh? Yeah, no, I'm just oh. making noise. Yeah, in order to find out more about... Uh, Krampus's back, uh, Krampus's uh, story, because apparently he came from Vault 300, as well as to get uh, more information for Winchester on a the chemicals and whatnot in order to kill them, and uh, being able to search inside the vault for any knowledge of the previous history. Now, for you, Rogue specifically, as they were going on through this entire thing, your character kind of took a detour for the most part, uh, where he just started kicking a bunch of gnomes. And then they start to be evil and attack you and almost try to kill you. And then Winchester picked you up. You're not quite sure how or why he picked you up. You weren't really paying attention at that time before y'all started running like a freaking jet engine. And then you got dropped off outside of a super mutant compound. But you found some more goddamn gnomes. So you went on another hunt for some goddamn gnomes. And then they started funneling outside of the area as you were stomping on the last poor pathetic gnome that decided to bite your foot. Yeah, true, true. I mean, so, I didn't know they're actually alive, but... So, you learn. I gotta ask. Mm -hmm. Is Rogue's character fucking insane? <laughs> Mine? Uh, I hope not. But it's a possibility, you, but... If, if you've been in the you Mojave... That one, we'll... Do you have that one trait from Fallout New Vegas where you just see random things in the wasteland? <laughs> Wild wasteland? So. Okay. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, one, that, that was guy good. I, I could because one was on fire and it was coming at me. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah, we're going we're yeah, gonna yeah. say I that... You, you technically have that trait, even though it's not technically canon. So you just get to see random things that no one else gets to see. On fire dogs running at you. Spaceships in the sky. Gnomes that bite your ankles. Why don't you tell anybody this? They think you're crazy. Well, then, what, can, what, if anything, what kind of spirit? Go ahead. Hmm? Uh, I just wanted to say this is a good example. This is a good explanation for why sometimes Rogue just isn't here. <laughs> true, true. Episode. I mean, the, if have you tried, have you set, have you stepped foot in the Mojave before? <laughs> it's very hot. <laughs> <laughs> very hot. And yeah, some of the people, some of the tribals there are. You've 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 partaken of the cactus juice many times. 
Yeah, I have. <laughs> I, I, I can admit that. You, you wondered what, what oh sunken uh, your ship was doing in the middle of a desert, but you never quite questioned it, nor could you find it again. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah, after a while, just don't quest. Just end up not questioning things. Mm -hmm. it's, it, it becomes a normal part of second life nature. there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like a nature. But, so you guys are traveling. I assume you guys don't have any cars or anything like that, so you're just kind of following the leader, which at the moment they is... They got a Winters. Krampus. I mean, you do have a Krampus, but I doubt any of them want to be bear-hugged by your sweaty chest as you run miles again. I mean, they also have... I actually have an idea. I mean, they also have a Winchester. <laughs> yeah, but you're a living death claw. I don't think any of them want to hug your scaly, not sweaty back. <laughs> oh god, do they sweat? Oh, oh, do they sweat? Oh god. Reptiles don't sweat. Thank god, that would be horrifying. All right, what was your idea, Jap Taxi? You have taxi. We'll ride on Krampus that sold us. For the rest of you, peasants, hold on to Winchester. I mean, but you know... Did he just call us peasants? The little uh, one... The little one can is allowed to ride on Winchester's back if ever she pleases. The little one... I just kind of... I kind of just, like, squint at Winchester <laughs> a little bit more. And I continue to snuggle into uh, Ace's back more. <laughs> The little one apparently does not. I am koalowing his back. God. I mean, then in that case, Ace could ride on on Winchester's back. So technically, uh, Winchester's carrying the both of them. I believe. Yeah, but I'm also paranoid. <laughs> you're a you're a giant death claw. I've had who experiences actually, with your kind before. Who I has literally so. spoken to you, and you can tell he has no <laughs> ill will to anybody in the group. If anything, he's more of a fatherly uh, type person, taking care he's... of everybody, trying to make sure everyone stays uh, healthy. That you concerns know, me. That he's met some good actors before. <laughs> he he knows not to trust anyone at face value. That's hey. fair. <laughs> Hello, Fitz. Oh, Fitz. You know, there's one person you can trust, though, and oh, it's Krampus, because you can trust that he will kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if you don't really believe insane. in Christmas. <laughs> So you guys have quite a ways ahead of you till you get to Vault 300. Uh, would you guys like to, you know, talk to each other during this several-day journey as you guys? That's actually a joke. Oh God. <laughs> uh, what's oh, the no. joke? What do you call a red roach that has been tamed? Reindeer. A dead run? <laughs> no, dog. No one can eat dog sometime. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, I. All oh, right, that is that is correct. I forgot that you had a pet uh, rad roach. Yeah. I yeah. look at the death claw and say, he tamed a rad roach. Yes, quite quite easily, I might add. He, we were we were going through a think I I would think a vault, uh, and we met yes, a broodmother I... rad roach. He tamed yes. one of her babies. I named him Doug. He Who the fuck are you people? <laughs> I <laughs> I am not questioning it. I come from a weird. Uh, I think not. Not this is kind of this is kind of normal from where I'm from. Who's there? Jap. Jap. Jap Taxi, the part of the major A. <laughs> As he's hanging off the back of Krampus, <laughs> upside down, holding his hand out towards Ace. I'm currently giving. <laughs> Uh, Sasaka, a piggyback ride, so my hands are a little bit full, but he <laughs> looks at you, sighs, and just nods his head. He shakes his hand like he's shaking your head. <laughs> uh, no! Oh, good god. Anyone got any folk tales of stories of jokes that. Who wants to sing a song? <laughs> Sasuke, about if none you start of you guys singing, I swear to God, you're gonna walk the rest of the way. <laughs> oh, jingle bells! Oh, jingle bells! <laughs> jingle all the way. So, uh, by the way, Fitz. Uh... You know what? You know what, Sasuke? Never mind. Go ahead. <laughs> 
So to give a little bit of uh, explanation on here, uh, this story that I've crafted more or less doesn't really fit into any of the games. It's a more homebrewed uh, idea of it. So the Death Claws specifically uh, were genetically engineered still by the FEV virus of a sort. However, there's a slightly different story to them, at least for some portion of them. The majority of them are slightly different. But yeah. So you guys are just walking around and you guys just start singing. <laughs> wait, wait, oh, I wait, have a on. song. Oh, oh God. no, Winchester has one too. Oh, what are you guys, what are you guys going to be singing? Should I turn down my, my groovy? No, no, they don't need Dashing groovy. Dashing through the snow. Awesome. You don't need groovy for mine. <laughs> oh, oh, no. No. <laughs> I have a feeling I know what she's planning. <laughs> See, Shanti's in the desert. <laughs> what do you do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? What would you do with a drunken sailor? What would we do with a drunken sailor? What would we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? Eat these eyeballs. <laughs> The whale man, the longest Jones. Oh my god. Yeah, so you all just start walking, you're singing god knows how many songs of every shape and form. None of you guys seem to question the fact that Rogue is in your party now. Uh <laughs> she, she also starts singing this song. Oh no. Yeah, I figured. Thank you for <laughs> not Sweet playing it. I would more than just I would have killed myself. <laughs> Either in way. real life and then out of in the game. Copyright! Jesus. <laughs> Copyright! <laughs> oh no. By the way, when did you get back? Oh, uh, well. No, Jack is still hanging upside down off of Winchester. Krampus. Oh, Krampus? Okay. Oh, yeah, he's. He took the he took the offer. You kidding him? <laughs> you just see yeah. like him hanging off like a ten foot tall super mutant who looks ripped, so, more ripped than the I, death claw. What do all y'all look like? Um. Well, I for one am a death claw. That's the best thing you can say about myself, at least. What the fuck do they look like? Giant lizard monster, I guess. What was that, Rogue? Uh, I was trying to you know answer. Uh, Jep. Uh, Jep. 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 Yeah. Jep. 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 Well, I always, I always have a thing I do. Mm -hmm. If I see a, do you know what a garden, a garden gnome is, right? <gasps> yes. I hear they eat people. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, I didn't believe that because all the ones I've gone after, that I've seen, were mm -hmm. just statues. But then, uh, uh, back a couple uh, stops, I noticed the one I kicked actually yelled and ran off. So I chased after him, which led to more gnomes. And uh, yeah, me and uh, I just, I just can't stand gnomes to be honest. Wait, it's squishing them. That's the guy. You a gnome? Are you no. a gnome? <laughs> uh, no, I am an elf, remember? But don't they both have pointy ears? Uh, yeah. El Call elves me a are gnome different. one more time and I'll bite your ankles. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that's Just on you. Jeff doesn't have any ankles. He has cankles. But, that, but oddly enough, that sounds something <laughs> extremely suspicious, like what a gnome would say. <laughs> Do you want to meet the end of my stick again? <laughs> Granted, I really can't feel your stick, considering I have giant thick, a thick hide of scales. To be but... fair, I thought you with a bunch of nine mil and it did nothing. I hit you with my stick last time, and you felt it last time. Well, I was just trying to, you know, not hurt your feelings, of course. But unfortunately, I Ace, can you can you move me closer? <laughs> I start walking closer. Winchester visibly starts moving away. <laughs> oh, by the way, so 
So you found a bunch of gnomes. That mm -hmm. led you back to us at some point. And to answer the little one's question, Jap is very, very handsome. <laughs> that, that, that is, like, like <laughs> fuck all of you. And yeah, Jap is telling the truth. He looks very good. He has a nice face. And he wears a very, very big hat. A I very, mean, very, very big hat? I mean, yes. Like, Can I wear your hat? Is. No. Please? Sasuke, his hat is the size of you. <laughs> <laughs> it's even more of a reason to wear it. I'm not handing you my hat. What if I ask nicely with the cherry on top? Not even then. <laughs> but if you did actually hand me a cherry, I might consider it. Though you're not getting my mask. Ever. No one gets You them. have a mask? Yep, that's actually very, very beautiful. That's why he has masks. <laughs> I always wondered yes, why uh, he wore a mask. Yes, Friend Jap has many masks. He has many he faces does. that he wears constantly, and they all do different things. Loki! As Jap starts pulling masks out of his bag. Loki, <laughs> You're Jap telling the blind girl to As look. soon as he says, Loki, I just get a deadpan look on my face like, did this fucker really just tell me to look? <laughs> <laughs> he did. Oh, I, I forgot. Jap isn't used to... What are you exactly? She's an, an elf, <laughs> according to all the lore I have given you. But, but, how can you see him? What does the damn hand look? Why is everybody looking at me like that? Is Jap missing something? <laughs> Jap, friend Jap, she, um, literally can't see anything. Her eyes do not work. Oh! So, Jap has a bunny mask. <laughs> he has a mask without a face. He's also got this weird, like, Demon looking thingy? I forget why I made this one. <laughs> oh, you should actually yeah. share your, your demon mask in the in the, your your mask in the chat. Uh Krampus, how do how do you respond to the elf asking you what you look like? Zero. Alright, huh? Zero's there. Oh there you are. <laughs> <laughs> I, I Sorry, Krampus respond. was making bed. <laughs> <laughs> That's an amazing image. Uh, how do you respond to the tiny elf asking you what you look like? Oh, she was asking that. Um, well, Krampus sort of just doesn't pay attention <laughs> until he hears his name. <laughs> Hey, right. <laughs> you, you you don't hear and, and Krampus, Krampus turning at all. <laughs> Krampus. Mm. Krampus. Mm. What what do you look like? Little boy. <laughs> <laughs> all you have in your mind is the image of a tiny child with the biggest feet of all time <laughs> no i you know what i'm thinking of i'm thinking of first met ace but ace would just stomp everywhere <laughs> unfortunately at the moment the campaign is not open for new characters having uh six is quite difficult to manage maybe in the future though depending on a few factors uh, okay someone hmm Oh, someone yeah. wants to join. Well, maybe if someone drops out. <laughs> yeah, if someone does. Okay, anyways, so as you guys kind of <laughs> wandering, it's been a couple of days. You guys get a little bit more knowledge for each other. Apparently, mostly in what you look like. In fact, that one of your partners sees gnomes a lot. And one of your partners is definitely not a gnome, but is very specifically an elf. I would assume that over time, they very quickly realize I'm sort of an alcoholic. <laughs> I, can, I can smell the booze. Christmas so juice. He, he, just, he just reaches into to those hurts. bag and just pulls out a drink and just drink and puts it back. <laughs> he had gnomes. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, interesting enough, your uh, two alcoholics in the in in the group are no longer in the group, so now you only have one alcoholic. <laughs> Question: hmm? When when Chester sees uh, sees Ace drinking, mm -hmm. he's gonna walk up to him. He's like, "Are you sure that that is very wise, considering you have a child on board?" 
<laughs> I take. Can I? Why do you Ace? think I drink? <laughs> can I have a sip, <laughs> Can you? Have when you're some... older. Damn it! <laughs> I try well, like every I, like once a week. I'll try. <laughs> I swear, at some point, you're going to start stealing. <laughs> no, I would never do that. That's me. No, I put it up I'm on a high bugging. shelf. I put it up no. in a tree every time I, we go wait. to sleep. Wait, wait, wait. I have Jeff has questions. Hmm? Y yes, Jeff? Can Jeff have food? Jeff, I, I, pull, I pull a bottle out, <laughs> take a drink of it, and then hand it to him. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Winchester's Did gonna you just fucking hand Jap a bottle? Oh, man. Winchester is gonna yeah. fucking smack it out of your out of your hands with his tail. He does not want to see Jap when he's drunk. Oh, God. I see the bottle hit the ground, <laughs> stare at it for a minute, and oh, you're dead. Sasuka can, Sasuka can feel me starting to reach for my gun. <laughs> Ace, Ace, Ace. He he he, he, sp he spilled the booze. I have to. I know. <laughs> no, Ace. Ace, it's okay. Hey, Remember, hey. we've talked about this. Hey, Ace. Ace. I think I still have. Yep, I still have it. As Jack pulls out whiskey, I stole it from <laughs> a drunk lady. She scared me, so I took her booze. <laughs> I know. I'm starting that to like Winston, him. I know that Winston created a party foul and um alcohol abuse but like <laughs> you don't need to kill him for it we've talked about this wait jab probably put in a vast of the booze in the first place jab not very very good with booze wait friend hmm? jab you've had booze this whole time yep hey hey jab can i have some i can i, I give him a look of if you hand her that <laughs> bottle i will kill you with it <laughs> Rap looks you dead in the eye through his mask even you can tell he has no idea what you're trying to tell him with your face <laughs> oh, hey I, you want the bottle I I um I pick up the bottle that was thrown to the ground <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> it uh it is almost comically small in your hands it's also mostly empty swallow the bottle <laughs> Oh my god. Oh wow. Wait, it? what? <laughs> He's gonna fucking eat the whole bottle. I, I'm i um, starting to reach for the bottle that Jap is offering me. And then I see behind, like over Jap's shoulder, just a super mutant <laughs> doing like, you remember that meme of the guy like swallowing a hot dog weenie hole? Yeah. <laughs> just see him doing that with a beer bottle <laughs> and I freeze <laughs> it funny enough does not affect you in the slightest <laughs> you would need some seriously strong alcohol to get through your endurance <laughs> and... I grab the whiskey and start chugging <laughs> uh, do me a favor uh, roll, me, uh, roll me a 1d100 if you would uh, at some Whoa. point I'll go organize this shit, but yeah. Oh, good. You're not drunk yet. You're uh, <laughs> you're slightly tipsy though, but you aren't drunk yet. Just the way I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Man, does that burn? All right, so <laughs> guys, just I could just imagine like a super mute just like holding a a bottle of super tiny whiskey or, or beer, which for normal people is about the size of your hand for him it's about the size of half of his hand <laughs> he, just, the size of a finger. <laughs> he just swallows it he, uh that's horrifying all right you guys are slowly walking have any more cookies you make cookies how do you make cookies in the wasteland very carefully in the desert sun <laughs> on the back of a that's like, uh, I don't know. Yeah. I, I, I start digging for a cookie. It's probably closer to a biscuit than it is like a cookie. Oh, you yeah. You have a cookie? 100%. Well, you have I, a I, extremely dry, crumbly, and hard as stone biscuit, but it's a cookie. It has chocolate in it. It's a hundred year old chocolate, but it's chocolate. 
chocolate I look go at bad. it, sniff it a little bit, shrug, and hand <laughs> it to her. I just start trying to eat it. Just gumming it. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Does she really have no teeth? She has no, teeth. No, I do. But, like, you know, it's so you know, difficult to chew. Roll me your endurance. Are you trying to bite it by any chance? I, I'm trying to chew on it. Roll, roll me endurance minus two. Oh, my God. The, the endurance minus two. I mean, I have a ten in endurance. So. Sorry, endurance minus she three. Has, no way. It, yeah. She has to chew on it. On, on, I mean, she's just it. carefully gnawing on it. She's not, like, breaking her teeth on it. Or maybe she is. Wow. What? Did I even roll? <laughs> you did. You yeah. rolled a 10 on 1d10. <laughs> so, as you, like, chomp on it, and your entire body kind of shivers slightly, as even your teeth, which are practically made out of steel at this point, can't get through this hunk of stone that this thing has turned into. <laughs> You don't know what this was made out of, but who is Nick? I'm assuming I noticed this. You you notice the clang of her teeth against it. it I kind of jump for audible. a minute. Like, what the hell are you doing back there? It's <laughs> legitimately like she tried taking a bite out of a boulder, but had chocolate inside of it. I I take the biscuit back. <laughs> you know I, I would like to search around like... for some water to pour on it, just to <laughs> soften it up a little bit. You have a little bit if of water. I can't, on if I can't no, find water, I, I was water. going to use I, booze. I'm I just mean, in my know. in my rolling backpack, I have a I have a crap ton of water. So yeah, I, just, I take a little bit of water and kind of like pour it over the I thing to make it softer and hand it back. Man, I care about to make a you hoo <laughs> You know, it's kind of like a whetstone now. <laughs> I can, it should I, be fine. I, if you handed it back to me and it's and I can tell it's wet, can I tell if it's a little bit squishier? It is slightly squishier. The uh, water seems to, to go into gently, it like a desert. <laughs> like very gently and carefully nom on it. Okay. Roll me endurance minus one this time. Oh no. <laughs> okay, you. I see you're very gently, very, very carefully attempting to. Oh. Fritz has a good point. If no water, then piss. Oh god. Ew. We have booze. It's fine. <laughs> I have purified water for a reason. You you slowly start spit. sinking your teeth into it. I, I do like a, a whetstone, it does um, make your teeth sharper, but... <laughs> yeah. I, I do have a question, Sin. Mm -hmm. When looking at the roll, it says mm -hmm. 10 plus negative 1 minus 7. Mm-hmm. So what basically, does it mean by the negative seven? so it rolls a so it's your endurance stat minus uh -huh. a plus or minus a modifier minus a one d ten. So if there's okay. no modifiers, it's ten minus a one d ten. If you get a zero okay. or above, you succeed. If you get a negative, you uh, do not. Which okay. if there that is no modifier, you instantly now. succeed. So, <clears throat> but yeah, okay. So <laughs> God. I'm just imagining Krampus trying to rip off a door, and I don't think there's a door in the wasteland that can work against him. It's like as if, a, if, if it's a super mutant gargantuan tried ripping off a door. <laughs> you would not expect the door to live. Okay, so as you guys are journeying through the area... Hey. Hmm? What? I would still try to rip off the door. <laughs> God. You eventually get to this little place which seems like a deserted camp for the most part it's not very interesting but it is on your way do you guys decide to sit around and look around or you guys uh press onwards mm. Mm. <laughs> is a very curious person winchester's just gonna walk out here and if he hears a noise he's just gonna go uh he's gonna go caveman spongebob just like oh <laughs> God, okay. Krampus Ace, is gone. Leave this up to you, because I don't know where the hell we are anymore. Krampus, Christmas is this way. Uh, 
I begin taking us over here. <laughs> okay, okay. To investigate so... what I assume is a building. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna roll this. Uh, okay, can you guys so all I see that? Uh -huh. I highly doubt that we can. I can actually fit through here. So Winchester just kind of. You can break your way through there. It's it's very I mean, broken. He is not a destructive person, but Krampus on the other Krampus hand. Is. He's gonna try and squeeze through it. <laughs> oh my god. What's your, uh, what's your dexterity? He's gonna try it. Doesn't... God, it doesn't your work, dexterity. he's gonna smash open. Yeah, you're agility as shit. Roll me, uh, roll me you agility. Know, you know, Krampus, you know, you know, you could probably literally just walk through the wall and just not even notice. <laughs> It's a nice so, build. I, I want me a or... <laughs> Alright. You are very, very bad at doing the uh, gentle movements as you try to shimmy your way through the little gap and you end up breaking half of it. Mostly from your rock hard abs. It, the, the rock kind of rubs against it and it's like rubbing a, a rock against a uh, yeah, I don't know what it'd be. It's like rubbing sandpaper against a rock, except the sandpaper is made out of the indestructible steel. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, it just breaks apart, and he just looks back, looks at Jap, thumbs up. <laughs> uh, uh, all of you roll the there's desert real quick. Uh, there's a hole. Jap is gonna walk through it as well. Roll what? Desert roll on the general religion. <laughs> yep. Ooh, grot wire. Nice. And what was it? Desert. Yeah. All desert. Right. All right. So, you, wow. Krampus found some powder. Uh, Ron. Okay. So, Sasuke, roll me 1d2. Uh, Ace, you found uncommon melee weapon. Uh, weapons. Okay. Melee <laughs> weapons. Uncommon. Hey! <laughs> Ace found a baseball bat. <laughs> Uh, Sasaka found one lockpick set, which y'all can sell. Uh, Jep Taxi, only me one D4. Oh, wait, uh... Oh, yeah, Rogue. Uh, roll me... Uh, what do I roll? Uh, so scroll uh, up, and you should find desert and, uh, general looting. Uh, desert, okay, let me mm -hmm. find it. Uh, and desert, okay. <laughs> Ooh, you found you found wood in a desert. <laughs> you found a tumbleweed. Uh, Ron, oh, roll me one d twenty, and same with you, Rogue. All right, let me twenty. This is and... part of the rafters of the building that fell down. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so Ron found thirteen found pounds wood. of scrap machinery, <laughs> and Rogue found six pounds of wood. Uh, Krampus, roll me one d four. Alright, you found two healing powders, which is very useful for Sasuke. Nice. So, you guys start finding all this stuff. Uh, Rogue manages to find <laughs> just, a, just a thick chunk of wood over next to where you guys are. I don't know how the rest of you missed this, but it's just a thick chunk of wood that he just starts piling into his inventory. Because, uh, as it turns okay. out, in the desert, wood is hard so to find. Ten. I'm going to mm -hmm. have to yes. ask now. I have scrap machinery. Mm -hmm. My guy is basically a technician. Mm -hmm. What can I make with this? So, I'm not going to make a thing at some point, but there's actually a crafting section later, but uh, I actually don't know how to do crafting right now, so I will explain that much later. That I think um, later. I think mostly it's used for uh, certain uh, you know, computer stuffs or something mm -hmm. of that sort. Uh you can so probably like use it to many... fix stuff too. So, so, so like you many... can help repair Nadia. <laughs> All right. So if, if basically a machine needs repairing, I'll have the the things basically to repair it. Nice. Yep. Unless you know you guys. You can also it. make weapon parts potentially. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. That's and then, yeah. So as you're wandering, uh, uh, Ace. You find a baseball bat laying inside one of the houses over here, right next to uh, some expanded lockpick sets, which uh, uh, Sasaka kind of kicks. <laughs> I, I smack it with my stick, yeah. and then I'm like, oh, that sounds familiar, <laughs> Ace. I, I look at her, 
Look at the baseball bat. Look at her stick. Look at the baseball bat. Look back at her. I'll trade you. <laughs> hmm. What What do you have in your hand that you want to trade? There's a chance. There's a I chance. Get the alcohol. Hand it to her. <laughs> I, I start feeling. <laughs> I feel up the bat. I start feeling up the baseball bat. Oh Testing God. the heft of your <laughs> newfound weapon. You start rubbing the baseball bat, and uh, it's. It takes you a few moments of awkwardly touching this baseball bat to understand the uh, full girth of this thing. <laughs> <laughs> but it's in fact a baseball here's the thing, bat. Though. Wouldn't the baseball bat be just as tall as her? Yeah, yeah, yes. just about, yeah. It would. <laughs> so that means that that's a two-handed weapon for her now. It's a very girthy no. baseball bat. Most things are two-handed weapons for her. <laughs> Even my own stick is a two-handed weapon. <laughs> a pistol is a two-handed weapon for her. I hand him the expanded lock picking set while I while I while I knock my bat <laughs> on the ground. Bonk, 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 bonk. I imagine her like swinging it around like a professional baseball player in like yeah, I would. that sort of I would. stance. Just Jesus get my baseball Christ. square up to the. Uh, to the home plate and start swinging it like I'm hitting a baseball. Good God. All right. You don't I even mean... know how to play baseball. You can't see. <laughs> Fuck! I just start swinging it in a circle. You do remember stories, however, of a, of a, of a blind Water. woman uh, in, in war at one point uh, hitting grenades with a baseball bat. You remember these stories viv vividly okay, because Irishman. they were told to you a lot. She was Irish and angry and drunk and really liked to hit grenades with a sledgehammer. Mmm. Sounds like my kind of person. <laughs> Good call, back soon. Of, of a game that used to be played way back before the war called Swatter. Swatter? <laughs> Trust me? Yeah, that's Fallout a Fallout 4. Fallout it's, water. <laughs> it's an actual thing in Fallout. Good God. All right. So as you guys no, technically kinda... Swatter is what the baseballs are, baseball bats are called. So I assume that you guys start baseball. regrouping and start um, walking through the uh, demolished doorway <laughs> and regroup. Winston! <laughs> oh no. What? You turn what? and you, you see. You said you couldn't feel my stick before. I mean, not. I got a better one now. <laughs> you turn and you see her walking up to you intimidatingly with a baseball bat, like a freaking pre war gangster okay, about sin, to beat you. Sin, 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 I'm going to blow your mind. Can I roll intimidation? You can try. I'm gonna have you both I was gonna roll. roll I was gonna say, can I intimidate him as I'm walking up with my bat? <laughs> I, I will have you both roll the intimidation. And Higher the one claw squaring up. <laughs> I'm fairly certain that uh, you get higher in terms of Oh, Ooh, God. I don't think you're rolling past that. That was a Can I real roll. What modifier do I need to use? Uh, none. <laughs> Sin, I have a question. Yeah. That I'm going to PM you. Okay. <laughs> I'm concerned. But okay. So I also find it funny how Tosca doesn't call Winchester by Winchester, it's Winston. Oops. Uh so you you guys start walking up to each other like friggin' uh a death claw, like spine rising upwards, growling. She just lifts her baseball bat, lifts her head and looks at you. And the look is very similar to as if you just awakened an ancient demon that was about to whip you. <laughs> and also, mind you, the reason why Winchester did the intimidation thing mm -hmm. was because of his death claw instinct starting to kick in. Mm -hmm. It saw a potential threat, so it, he started like you know getting into it. Then the Winchester came back, and now he's fucking terrified about the piss. Guys, but sin, I have sin. Mm -hmm. I need you to answer oh, that yeah, question. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I rolled. <laughs> Uh, as you guys are doing this, you you are about to act terrified, and then you realize something, something that uh, that that the poor tiny child cannot see, thankfully. But Ace can. Ace can see this really well. Jap Taxi's walking towards you two, trying to stop you, and uh, he has no pants on. 
My oh. eyes go wide. I grab Sasuke and start backing away. <laughs> oh, God. Guys, is this supposed to be a bit windy? Uh, yeah. Um... By the way, has anyone really seen Jeff's pants? I seem Wait. to have lost them. Sin? Um, Sin? Yeah. Can I roll? I want to roll a d20. Mm hmm. And I need to know would it be above a 10 or below a 10? If Winchester act for some reason has them stuck to his horns. <laughs> you know what? Let's go with above a ten. You, you, you was having your horns. It would just fly through the wind. For some reason, my pants. For some reason, your pants are all are, are are like you know one of the pant legs is on his horn, just hanging there. You mean my pants, Winchester? I, I he starts walking up to you pantsless. Winchester, not really, you know, registering this because he doesn't perceive nudity, just kind of bends down to him. He's like, I have no idea how they even got there. Yeah, his jet puts his pants back on. No. But we you attempt to. About... You, you do attempt to. But you hear a barking noise as a doggo runs next to you and snatches your pants out of your hand and starts running over to hear. <laughs> Can... I hear the dog running, right? You hear yeah. the dog running because it's loud. It's also big. It's like half the size of Chat Taxi. <laughs> Can I try and trip the dog? Uh, Ace is holding you and r walking away from the naked That's No, true. I just like grabbed her by the shoulders and started oh. <laughs> backing her away. So, unfortunately... I don't carry her unless I absolutely have to. Dude, that's yeah, heavy. And you've forgotten the one thing we agreed on with Jap. Hmm? He's faster when he's naked. Oh god. <laughs> oh yeah. You know what? That, that's a fair point. Let me. So let me. Means, let me do so something means, here. So that means currently, Jap taxi is streaking. Oh. 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 oh god. <laughs> This is one of the moments where I'm really glad Sasuke is blind. Uh, yeah, roll, roll me roll me a 1d20 plus 3. The real question we need to be asking is, does he wear underwear underneath his pants? <laughs> yes, Jap is not that kind of person. <laughs> Thank God. Yeah, I had a feeling, but, all right, but I can already tell what kind of pant underwear they are. It's the heart boxers. You you almost snatch it. it you, you have lost your pants once day. You were determined not to lose it again. But this dog, this dog was quick. This dog was a ninja. Also, the bullet whizzing by your head was a, uh, a bit of an oddity. <laughs> I have a solution to my pants problem. Oh? Krampus! The dog stole the Christmas pants. <laughs> I pull out my axe to kill it. <laughs> You hear across the ways, oh, no. you kill my dog, I kill your child. That is anyway. my gun drone instantly. <laughs> you, you do her. notice I a muzzle. Raising my <laughs> you, you do I'm notice a muzzle of a gun over here, uh, but you're fairly certain that the, uh, the threat was very intense there. So, <laughs> Jeff Peckett's pants! <laughs> Uh, with, Where? No. I'm, I'm going over there. I'm getting him. Rex dropping. Rex is going over there. <laughs> uh, Ace, look me at him. They called me a child. I had to kill him. The, uh, the dog drops I the pants uh, like at the uh, edge of this uh, building uh, as it jumps over the building, essentially. And the muzzle shot once again flings next to uh, Sasako. I, would I mean, I started, as soon as Ace let me go, I started running straight forward because I don't know where they're at. Mm -hmm. But I started running straight forward because I need to kill them for calling me a child. <laughs> yeah, a bullet I, I hits the ground the uh, next to, to y'all. <laughs> I... Winchester just starts climbing. Is that de That's a death claw. She puts the gun in your mouth, essentially. <laughs> You also notice what? that she has uh, another one set up as well. This lady is very prepared. So, so look, it's dead silence for a quick moment, and then she hears, "Listen, is it possible that we could like talk out this situation? Because I would prefer not to die." You have a gun barrel in your mouth. <laughs> he doesn't speak with his mouth. 
She she looks oh, at yeah, that's right. She looks at the super mutant walking <laughs> upwards toward like at, at standing at the thing holding the, the pants. Like the, the super mutant no, just grabs no. the pants and it's just holding it, kinda like moving like, side to Christmas side pants. like a champion. Because <laughs> the Christmas pants. <laughs> yeah. And Can Jeff has got the Christmas pants. Can Jeff have his pants back? There you go. Thank you. <laughs> on his pants and, again. The the girl is like, I, I mean, we can talk about this nice and easy. Uh, you did loot my, well, camp of sorts, and you also Tasty almost murdered eyeballs. my dog. I steal my pants. Granted, yeah. your dog did steal my friend's, uh, the, you know, bottom garments. Rex is very excitable. Thank you. Jeb, I no. I have one question. She shouts over to you. Yes? No, not for her, for DM. Oh, yeah. Uh, since Sasuke just started running straight forward because mm -hmm. she was angry, she obviously oh. wasn't using her blind stick. Um. <laughs> uh, can I roll a something, like a reflex, to a see what she's doing and tell her, Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll be uh we'll be perception minus three since you are at the, we're just now being shot at by a rifle. <laughs> perception modifier three minus three. Minus three. I feel like uh, Sasuke's gonna about to smack into a wall. There's a fairly high chance. Oh, okay, you did notice. Oh! <laughs> barely. <laughs> you do notice <laughs> just barely that her face is about to meet a fantastic brick wall that is very stable, shockingly. Oh god. Stable for now. <laughs> and once her face oh meets god. it, it won't be. I am <laughs> running full dead sprint, by no, the way. No, no, you, this is no, like a no. dead sprint with no, my bat you, up, like I'm gonna hit something. No, here's the best part. You know what would be funny? She mm. just runs right through the wall, doesn't even notice it, and tears it down. <laughs> That, that is a possibility. Uh, do you do you tell the tiny midget that she's about to break her skull on a wall? <laughs> well, break the wall on her skull. Yes, I I, I scream wall at her. Um, We've done this okay. before. She should know what's going on. Okay, if he screams wall, um, <clears throat> even I turn left, odd I turn right. Why okay. don't you just stop? <laughs> Because I'm going too fast. I'm in a dead sprint. You can't just stop immediately. You could, you could the shoulder the check the door. Sprint. You could shoulder yeah. check the wall. I mean, I'm going to have no. to turn either left or right in order to slow Wait. down enough that I'm not going to break a <laughs> fucking ankle Wait. or something. Wait, are you guys, you guys telling me that you guys can't come to a dead stop in a full sprint? It's pretty hard to do so, depending on what's on your back. No, it's not. I can do it easily. I can mm -hmm. just literally go from I can I can go from a dead sprint to just stop. It depends on how I have fast a feeling your dead tall. sprint isn't that fast. <laughs> <laughs> you get winded going up the stairs. It really depends on how yeah, fast you're moving I'm and running, uh I was running up the stairs, so you know, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, it depends on how fast you're moving. If you're super super small, you can actually push yourself so far your momentum physically won't let your feet stop essentially uh which is why i can't stop easily if i'm running too fast because my momentum will fling my upper half forwards if my lower half stops <laughs> at least i turn right and i'm heading straight to ace oh and ace can catch me <laughs> i i grab her <laughs> do you Before slow down at all or are you just going full speed into <laughs> Well, as soon as he yells wall, I start trying to slow down and I turn to the right and continue <laughs> to try and slow down, but I don't know how well that's going to work considering there's a whole bunch of rubble right here and lots of stuff to trip on. <laughs> well, unfortunately, that's going to be an agility check, which is automatically at minus two. <laughs> you, uh, you're going to hurt Ace here. <laughs> you are made out of something thick. And uh, <laughs> he is not a very not durable eat the person. Ground first. <laughs> what would that be? Could I could I act as a buffer? Uh, in some way, I just want to keep her behind the wall and out of. 
line you, you of sight. Can, you can roll agility minus two to catch her as she's flying through the air of her own volition. <laughs> I'm about to eat so much dirt. As you trip and start flying through the air, he sees you and freaking dive bombs to catch you and land. Which hurts a bit. Mostly because he just shoved his arm into a pile of rubble. <laughs> uh, sorry, not his arm. Does his entire drugs? shoulder. <laughs> Do you need drugs? God, I don't know yet. <laughs> okay. You hit the ground, I mean, and Rogue is just drugs. watching you two at this point, it seems. I look up at him from the ground, stare him in the eye, and say... No one speaks a word of this. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Who is it? Who is it? Good. Uh, uh, what? I know. Good answer. Up. And I stand up. The girl, the girl looks at Winchester and uh, Krampus, and she's like, "What are you, f well, fellows, doing on my lawn?" You notice that she is quite old. She, her hair is completely gray, and she looks very mean. Our dog is barking happily next to her, wagging its tail. It also looks fairly old. <clears throat> Winchester? Krampus just plops on the ground, crisscross <laughs> applesauce, staring at her like a child. Uh, roll me uh, agility minus two, Jap. And, uh, Ron, you still there? No, oh, no, he's muted. Okay. <laughs> oh, there you are. Every time people just go on tangents with their characters, I'm just like, well, I'm here now. Time to go watch YouTube. <laughs> tangents are fun. Oh, God. <laughs> Jeff starts climbing the wall as she just stares at you. <laughs> Now, uh, about this talk, can you please remove the gun from my mouth? It's very, um, hard on... Oh, what's the word? Uh, <laughs> Intimidating? Uh, well, not not exactly. <laughs> I mean, the, the gun itself is very intimidating, yes, but the, the person holding it, usually not. Unless, of course, you're talking about the little one down there. <laughs> Thankfully, I don't think she hears you. She pulls out the pistol from your mouth. You know, this is a really big pistol. And points it directly at one of your eyeballs. <laughs> she can physically see his eyes kind of get wide a bit as he perceives that it's in front of him. <laughs> um, please do not hurt my brain. My brain is the best part of me. Hmm. She looks at Jap Taxi as he runs up the wall. Which is really weird to look at. The rest of you get to see a, uh... Did you put on your pants before you ran up the wall? Yes. You're having yes. <laughs> <laughs> I was, no, I was I not entirely push sure push if you wall. if you were too excited by the appearance of a new person to put on your pants. <laughs> no, no, he puts on his pants first. He okay. has to be presentable. Come on. God. I know. He at least has some mannerisms. She, she looks at you. The gun unwavering from the death claw's eyeball. Hello. Hi. Oh dear, here we go. Knock knock. Who's there? Yeah. She looks over at Winchester, looks back at Jap. Jap who? Jap Tech the pleasure to make your acquaintance if he holds out his hands as per Jap fashion. She raises up her left hand since her right hand is occupied and shakes it. My name is Amanda. Nice to meet you. What? The, what? Krampus the doesn't name? understand joke. <laughs> it's not supposed to. It's <laughs> his form of greeting, Krampus. God. It is a joke, though. Where's right? the knock knock? <laughs> it, it's, it's imaginary. Like this, and he knocks on your head hard as hell. <laughs> You, you can feel your scales like like almost indenting from his knocks. <laughs> so knock you, knock. So do you mind taking the gun out of his face? Depends on whether or not he decides to get closer to me. 
I'm okay. going to ask for this. Oh, after please. This. He's a pacifist. He's going to do. He can't even hurt a fly. She looks at the <laughs> raging death claw. <laughs> he wasn't raging. He was just running over to ask her to politely stop. <laughs> I mean, you say the raging death claw. What she sees is a cowering weakling holding his head. <laughs> Yeah, now especially. While also getting his head knocked. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, she just witnessed him getting knocked by a super mutant. <laughs> she shrugs and moves the gun over to your face. <laughs> yeah, but it's okay with this. I've had many a gun pointed in my face, including the minigun. The yeah. minigun was the most interesting. Well, when you live as long as I do, you learn a very simple rule. If you have a bunch of people in front of you, you have a gun on at least one of them. And they don't try to kill you as often. Why would I try to kill Krampus you? Don't I have you. Krampus, you are a gun. <laughs> he looks at his ass. <laughs> <laughs> no. but, it's not as, but it's not as fast. <laughs> you've, uh, you've definitely heard it uh, poot poot before. But... <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, where was I? Oh, yeah. So, um, why are you pointing a gun at us? Well, because he's a, she's someone from the wastelands, and everyone in the wasteland knows that everyone else of the from the wasteland is either a an enemy or b lying. That's a lie, though. Can't be friends with everybody. Yes, she raises her eyebrow. <laughs> I would prefer to make friends than actually fight anything. Y'all you know have the weirdest group I've ever heard of. Uh, I mean, cowering I death Join the claw. club. <laughs> cowering death claw, a super mutant that doesn't know which way his ass is. Actually, well, that's <laughs> that, that's par for the course. Uh, I mean, I mean, he a super mutant that's obsessed with Christmas. Okay, go. that's not par for the course. She looks at Jab. Whatever the hell you are. Hey, I'm a perfectly normal human male, thank you. Yes, he is very much perfectly normal. I mean, granted, his mind may be a little bit shattered, but that's not... I'm shattered on Jappa. That's why you call me Jap, because I'm Jappy. She, What's I, I, Jap? I, she, she continues to have a look of pure, dumbfounded confusion on her face as she anyway, looks past you guys at the midget and two... what? Basically bodyguards. <laughs> so Winchester goes over to Jap and kind of just slightly pats him on the head. And he's just like, Jap, my friend, understand you're fractured, I'm afraid. Your mind is not what it used to be. Although it's, very, it's still very much intact, I have to admit. But Can you please take your hand off Jap? There's a gun in Jap's face right now. Jap doesn't want to be shot and he can't move his head if your hand is there. Right. But... Shockingly, yeah. Winchester... The crumbling ground under you, because you're standing on a wall, isn't falling. Well, that's a good sign. Yeah. <laughs> she has no, a cause... very sturdy wall. <laughs> By the way, why did your dog steal my pants? Uh, he's very rowdy at times. He likes to find things for me, and uh, pants are his favorite object. Well then, Jap, well then, Jap, my friend, try to keep your pants on more often. <laughs> well, it me who lost them in the first place. He needs a belt. <laughs> I have a belt. It has a smiley face as he takes off his belt. Oh my god. Hey, his <laughs> pants fall down. <laughs> Uh, you, 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 you like, turn to the blind woman as you show off your belt and you're like, see? <laughs> drop right in front of this woman she's pointing a gun at you're, it. you're trying to show a blind woman your belt who is also like 80 feet away from you behind a wall <laughs> Jab Krampus like sees no hair look Jab may be kind of stupid no 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 it's fine I think he pulls his pants back up puts on the belt no where were we oh yeah gun in the face um do you mind taking that out of Jab's face maybe aim it you know, at the ground? It, well, to be fair, even if you shot at Jap, the likelihood of you hitting Jap is lower than more. Especially if Jap took off all of his clothes. <laughs> point at me. Point at me. <laughs> she looks at the super mutant, 
puts away her pistol and shoves her sniper rifle at his face. No. Um, what the way is a uh, Vault 300? Why you folks yeah. won't go there? That place is I hell. have no bloody clue. That's where they want to go, and I'm following. Look, I've been following. I've been like sitting on the. I've been sitting on Krampus' shoulders for like a week. My butt hurts. I'm going to be standing for more than two seconds. And to be fair, why are you pointing a gun at us in the first place? Jeff, you could have just let us pass. Pay for it. What? Jeff, my friend, please, please listen. Allow me to do the talking. All right. I'm all... the talking. Because that totally down. couldn't end, end in disaster, you hear Ace say. Jeff hasn't gotten to do this in a month! Can Jeff throw you a magic trick? Uh, brain hurts. Winchester grabs a hold of Jeff with two claws, hands him over to Krampus, and is like, Here, yeah, Krampus, keep an eye on the on the Christmas in. No! <laughs> Jeff wanna do his magic trick! Krampus. But Jeff only got to do his magic trick in the moon. Too much words. A Christmas magic. Wait, 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 wait. Jeff, wait, you're holding, you're putting Jeff in front of the gun again. <laughs> no, forget it. Jeff did this magic trick, none of you can stop him. Sin, I would like to do my magic trick with the eyes. <laughs> so, Krampus, you hear him say Christmas magic. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't he doesn't hear anything. He's getting mad because there's too many people talking. Oh yeah. His head's hurting. He legit He's slowly <laughs> pulling out his axe. <laughs> oh god. Alright, well uh Ace you see Krampus start to get angry and uh that's not a fun sight. <laughs> uh feel free to throwing <clears throat> Yeah. Do some throwing. Yeah, see if throwing. see if you can do a you know perfect magic trick. <laughs> 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 yeah, all 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 you're hearing uh, <laughs> any modifier? No. All you all you're hearing, Sasuka, is blah 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 Christmas too much talking and you hear her axe being unsheathed. Also Where magic you... apparently. As Jap was now juggling his knives. <laughs> you can hear knives like sliding past each other in the air and it slightly concerns you. Where's my Christmas? Hey, Krampus. <laughs> Krampus, look, look, Christmas knives. <laughs> Christmas Krampus not happy. <laughs> look, at them, look at them spin. <laughs> yes, look at them. How they gleam in the starlight. It is my time. Uh, just, just let him watch the for a bit. He'll forget about it. <laughs> just staring at the both of you, what, <laughs> menacingly, <laughs> with his axe out. <laughs> uh, Sasaka, I believe, although I'm not entirely sure. Friend Jeb, you... please tell, please tell me that you know how to do hypnotism. <laughs> Never took that class. Uh, Sasuke, I, I think I you tell... technically have some uh, sleeper agents in your bag. In other words, hey, yeah! I, I was gonna ask. I was gonna tell her to tell him to calm down. <laughs> I feel like if 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 Santa's head elf tells him to calm down, where he's going on the naughty list, I feel like it would. <laughs> I can I enough. can I can physically hear Krampus getting upset, can't I? Uh, yeah, h him getting upset is like a woolly mammoth about to charge you. They're, they're, it's okay. it's very All right. audible. Alright, so this is what happens. I step out I step out next next. I step out over here, right? Uh -huh. So so that way, I know I'm out in the open and people can see me and if mm -hmm. people can see me, then I'm pretty sure Krampus can see me. And what I, I do next you. is I stand there with my stick in hand. So you know how like uh, in Lord of the Rings, when oh, Gandalf God. is standing there with his stick on top of the, the yeah, yeah. The... <laughs> yeah, so I'm standing there like that, holding my stick like that, ah. and I'm like, Grampus, charge at anyone or hurt anyone, 
and you'll be on the naughty list. <laughs> and I will tell Santa immediately. <laughs> you, you, Jeff and uh, Winchester. Okay, Winchester, you guys see as he's still staring at you. Then he just sort of like straightens up. An unholy scream comes out as he starts just jumping up and down. Bot brain hurts, bot brain hurts, bot brain hurts. Which is gonna. Okay, here. okay, look, look. This is going to probably get him killed. Oh, God. But Winchester is going to push him off the wall. <laughs> I mean, I did. I just asked Krampus to come here, so. So that's probably, that's probably a good plan. Uh, the wall is that's crumbling crazy. beneath you, by the way, as he's stomping, yeah, so that's also. Yeah. <laughs> He's a big fucker jumping on a crumbling wall already. Uh, ah. You're pushing him as he's jumping, so you have so much strength. I don't think it matters why I tell you not to, to roll. So uh, <laughs> you, you push him as he's jumping, and he kind of just goes <laughs> head first into the ground. <laughs> like a peacock. Like a... No, ostrich. And then you, you hear a muffled voice underneath. Oh, Krampus feel much better. <laughs> Sometimes the simplest problems require the simplest solutions. <laughs> Amanda at this point is looking at you like... She's so confused. She can't put it into words. She just this takes her gun... We just come on the heart of me. She, she just takes her gun... And, and slowly slings it around her back, her, her sniper. It leans back against her dog. She just gets the nice side of uh, Krampus with his head in the sand, scratching his ass, <laughs> enjoying his moment. <laughs> his moment of uh, silence, finally. Oh, yes. I'll, I'll, let, I'll let all of you, you pass... Real quick, and we never have to discuss this again. <laughs> no, besides, also, what was your name again? Amanda. Yeah, and, and, uh, Amanda, it, it was a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Right. Was Jeff entertaining? Yes. Yeah, yes. You were very Yay! Nice. Yes, Jeff jumps down the, the, the thing. I... Oh, Dearly hope I never meet any of you again. If you, well, club, my dear. you probably will. You probably meet me again, but you won't recognize me. Uh huh. Uh. If you're ever in Junction City, don't be. <laughs> she, ja, Winchester just looks at her for a moment, kind of tilts his head a bit before he kind of gets into like a pouncing stage. As he's facing the other, like, you know, to, like, you know, that uh -huh. way of the wall. He just leaps down. Don't, don't, don't ever try to find me. Ever. What, was it just me or did other people envision when Winchester was crouching down into a leaping position? He, he was going to do the cat butt wiggle and then he jumps? No, no, he did. That's the way I'm saying it. That's how he oh, got down. He God. got down. She, she has like, seen. Oh, That's she why has... I said he gets down to a pouncing uh, pose. He gets this down he this has woman down. has seen three different species' ass in the last <laughs> ten minutes. The question is, which one did she like? <laughs> she may shoot herself later. <laughs> Means I none just, of them. If I, if I catch her eye, catch her attention... Uh-huh. Ace is just gonna, like, mouth to her, Take me with you. <laughs> By the way, do me a favor and, uh, don't shoot my dog. If you ever come across my dog. Why don't we shoot the cute pooch? I love animals. Stares at Krampus's ass. <laughs> just wiggles. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Winchester and maybe back. maybe have farted a bit so. <laughs> so Winchester kind of reaches over grabs him by both his legs for some reason he is, his hands are very dexterous for a death claw and just starts to pull him out <laughs> <laughs> and 
Hello, Krampus. Welcome back to the world. So bright. You see I... her, her, put her head in her hands, and her dog hands her a bottle of vodka. <laughs> Does Ace see this? Oh. Yeah, you do. Ace, Ace just, like, out loud mumbles <laughs> under his breath. I gotta get me one of those. <laughs> or, get you one of what? And, uh, nothing, Sasuke. Don't worry about it. That's a lie. Tell me. I really want to know what he means. Does he bottle the vodka or the woman? Uh, he means the <laughs> vodka tossing dog. Oh, I, 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 okay, look, I messed up. I, I, I was supposed to say the vodka, the dog, or the woman. Oh, good God. Uh, <laughs> if you want to try a lie to her, you can hold deception against her detection. <laughs> this is not going to end well for me. I can already <laughs> tell, but I'm trying it anyway. No modifiers for you, for you. Oh, my God. Mine's a detection? Oh, yeah. God. That's so bad. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, she has about even detection. <laughs> oh, okay. Just... She manages to detect you anyways. <clears throat> she manages to detect you. I'm you gonna, guys got the I'm same role. I'm gonna play role. it off. You guys got I, the I'm same gonna... role. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play it off. Like, I, I, like, he fooled me, but I know. I know. <laughs> that he's lying to me. This is horrifying. You, you can almost Ace, feel... I can imagine Ace just gets a, like a tingle down his spine <laughs> as if it's like, I haven't heard the last of this conversation. <laughs> Are we talking about stealing booze right now? No. <laughs> we're talking about the... Yeah. We're, we're uh, talking forgot... about Ace lying to Sasuke. <laughs> I've got much booze that you have inside of Winchester's backpack at the moment. Well, inside of your backpack on his back. But you're uh, right, Ron. Krampus hasn't touched you yet. Say that he Jap took all of what's your face's booze. Wait, did you steal all of Amanda's booze? <laughs> she got blown up, and all of her items were left behind. Oh, you mean you mean uh uh vixens? I, can booze. I try to steal all of Amanda's booze? Die. You can't. You. She is currently attempting to drink herself to unconsciousness right now, but her dog is supplying her booze. So you, you, you can attempt to get past her dog. <laughs> Don't take a living Wait, person's I a booze. That's I have just an idea. Wrong. I want to convince the dog to hand me a bottle of booze. Oh, will be animalism. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh wow. You just, you just look at the dog. And you, 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 just, you just start shaking a little bit. The dog looks confused. So you just point to your alcohol. And the dog nods and yelps before grabbing a bottle of vodka and running to you. Thank you. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> All you hear, Sasuke, is. Woof! Thank you. I immediately fuck? start walking towards him, like, "Hey, buddy, how are you?" <laughs> hey, buddy, how friend? Sin, how strong is this booze alcohol-wise? Uh, it's vodka, so really strong. It's. Yes, it's gonna put this in his bag. As he shoves in his bag, pulls out the whiskey from earlier. There you go. I think I already took the whiskey from earlier. You didn't. You stopped because of what's his face is uh, eating Jester. a whole bottle like a hot. Yeah, drink. I saw that. Paused for a minute and then started downing the entire bottle. Oh, never mind then. He just like puts it in his bag and slings it back over his back. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh my God, the the woman looks at you all. Currently now very tipsy. Uh, turns out half a bottle of vodka is, uh, very unpleasant, but she looks at you, she's like, ooh, if y'all looking for, uh, Vault 300, A, it's a death wish, but B, uh, somewhere down there, uh, just keep going, you'll find it, 
It's very obvious. Yeah, they weren't subtle about nothing. They really weren't. No. Oh. Rexy oh. boy, where be you? <laughs> Winchester and Gap are already just kind of on the way. <laughs> As we're heading down nice. this way, uh -huh. is it, can I stop in, in, in front of her? Uh, sure, you have to yeah, kind of climb, of but right. she's hanging down anyways, so. A mirror right yeah. there. Yeah, I'll meet, her, I'll meet her down here. <laughs> and I and I turned her, I, and I'm using my stick like my blind stick, and I turned to her and I hit the sides of her feet to like see where she's standing and mm -hmm. where she's facing. But I don't hit it very hard, it's just like a gentle yeah. tap, just to like tell. You can see, you can like feel her wobbling. Okay. Mm. I turn and face her. And I immediately... Make sure that nobody is looking, <laughs> and turn back to her, mm -hmm. and get the darkest possible look on my face. And okay. I look up at her face. Mm -hmm. I I want to just say, would my character really like not take, like, would he take his eyes off of her ever? Yeah, you're probably <laughs> around this corner, and like you're like looking back at her, like you're like turning the corner like like leaning over like you know that, that like scene that like gif of somebody like leaning over like a uh, corner at a uh, street at just like staring at her <laughs> mostly because you want to pretend like she's not going to know that you're there mostly so she Fair doesn't enough. kill you <laughs> yeah so then so then i get the dark look on my face mm-hmm and, and I and I point my face up at approximately where I I would assume her face is. Mm -hmm. If you ever dare oh, to no. call me a mother fucking child again, you won't live to see another two seconds. Woo! You got some. You know she just kind of. Her, her, she just kind of like fades off slightly. She's like, "Spunk to you, Rexy here would have a lot of fun with you." Ain't ain't that right? Ain't that? She just starts is, like turning how, in a circle. How, what kind of a dog is Rex? Uh, it's bigger than you are, and probably like forty pounds heavier than you are. It's a big pupper. It's like half her size on its hind legs. It's taller than she is. It's a big pupper. So it's a great so like Dane. A, like a Great Dane. Kind of, yeah. It's also or, or very muscular. A <laughs> new like, a mastiff. A mm -hmm. mastiff. Yeah, it, it could have been a Newfoundland. Something like that. It's a really big dog, and you like even like as it like runs up to you, panting, you can visibly feel from like the vibrations right next to you the muscles under its coat as it's like moving, and then it starts like brushing up against you, and there's like a little bit of padding because like the fur, and then there's just the raw muscle grinding against your shoulder. Mm. I have great Which, crackers. Actually, would be near your head more than your shoulder because it, it standing on all four is still taller than you. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so so it's I could a... technically ride this dog if I wanted to. Oh, hundred percent easily. It, it's like rubbing against you, and it's it's like it's like having to keep itself from falling on you because it's not used to someone of your stature. <laughs> so what you're saying is is that Sasuka found a new mount. <laughs> Go take this woman's doggo. Unless you're sure. <laughs> oh no! But I don't think you'd be very receptive to that. Uh, Krampus, have have you started following them, or are you just you just kind of staying there? Krampus. Krampus. Uh huh. Uh, did he die? Hello. <laughs> he died. He died. <laughs> Krampus dead. <laughs> <laughs> I I just see like Krampus like staring forwards. And he just like slowly starts tumbling forwards as a hulking giant of a of a creature just starts rolling ever so slightly forwards, kind of vaguely in your eyes' direction. <laughs> Krampus is having technical issues. 
<laughs> he starts following all you guys, happy as can be. Oh my god. She she looks at you, she's like, You got some spunk on your ex would like have fun with you. He he likes to 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 wrestle. Yeah. Rex, more booze! <laughs> it rushes off in a direction. Ah. Uh, he'll be back. I'm At that point, I'm gonna turn around and start vehicles, walking. Oh. I'm gonna turn 180 <laughs> degrees so I'm facing directly the opposite way I was facing and start walking forward until Ace grabs me. <laughs> I whistle for you, so you know okay. where I am, more or less. <laughs> yeah, I start walking <laughs> towards the whistle like a motherfucking dog. Good job. I can tell by what kind of whistle he uses what to do. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, you guys have learned from many years of, of whistling that... Uh... <laughs> that just sounds weird. <laughs> Yo, guys, hmm? this animation, though... <laughs> oh my god, what? Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's like Scooby-Doo on crack is what this dog is like. Yeah. This dog is a big boy. But the, uh, the, uh, vault, as she stated, is not actually super far. It only takes you guys now, like, half a day-ish to get there. Um, do you guys spend your time singing some more shanties? Yes. <laughs> Might as well. Hold on, I've got a, I got a good song. Oh God. Ace is just like, as the singing starts to kick up, he starts sifting through his bag to see if he ever kept any earplugs. Uh. Unfortunately, uh, they, if you have found any earplugs in the wasteland, they are old as shit, and I don't think you want to put those. Probably in your disgusting. Ears. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you said it's another half day away. Yeah, roughly a half day or so. So I'm going to gonna take a nap it. on Ace's shoulders. Oh, great. Now she's dead weight. <laughs> <laughs> Not very heavy dead weight, thankfully. But <laughs> Clearly, you've never tried to carry a sleeping child. <laughs> oh, they're fun. Uh, but I yeah. mean, I'm only like 26 pounds of dead weight. <laughs> Plus your 300 pounds of uh, bag. <laughs> it's not 300. That's on you. It's actually only 115.625 pounds. God damn, Excuse she you. counted the decimals. <laughs> yeah, she, we, we, we spent a while calculating. <laughs> we recalculated that number like seven times. We did. You got a different number like the first four. <laughs> God, it took us forever. Yeah, she has a shit ton of things in that bag. All of which are just kind of jangling in, in behind you as, as you're moving along. You're not entirely sure what's in there, and you're pretty sure she will kill you if you try searching it. <laughs> yeah. Touch but, it, yeah. and you meet my new friend, the baseball bat. <laughs> you're gonna name that thing eventually, I swear. I, I'm going to. You're gonna have a dream where you name it, and you're like, this is what it is. Jesus Christ. Okay, so someone hand her a kid's menu. <laughs> what? I, on I would only order the chicken nuggets. <sighs> I can see that. Good, good. Alright, so you guys eventually make camp. The uh, the vault is actually in sight at this point. At least the, the door is, for the most part. Uh, it seems to be partially above ground, and you assume partially underground from uh, what is uh, looking like. It's like a giant door, and then it's like a slope downwards of metal into a uh, what looks to be underground area. It's kind of spoopy, and it is nighttime. And you guys do hear... Not much, actually. It's it's very dark, very cold. I assume you guys start a fire. <laughs> yes, I have the stuff to start a fire, yeah. and I also start but cooking dinner. <laughs> but you're asleep. Does Ace wake you up for you to do the dinner chores? 
I mean, you guys. Yes, are... because if I cooked, she would complain again. I mean, you guys. Could have... I mean, listen, you guys could let Winchester do it. He has cooked for himself. That's true. You I've cooked for myself too. That doesn't yeah. mean it's good. <laughs> yeah, so... I'm not allowed in the kitchen after what happened last time. No, oh, God. <laughs> So you, you you wake her up, she starts, you know, titty tatting and uh Why what? <laughs> I don't know what word just came out. It's like she's like moving back and forth. Like, very very Did tired. Titty tatting? <laughs> I heard titty tapping. Yeah. I heard yeah, I heard tapping. No, tatting. Like 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 oh shit. I think titties. <laughs> I think you meant to say pity patting. Sure, yeah, pitter that would. Yeah, pitter pitter like that. Yeah, you just kind of like get off it. It's very, very cold, very dark, and this only means one thing. You need a fire. Which, thankfully, Rogue found some wood. I can start it. I know how to start mm -hmm. it. Yeah, somehow, you guys hot some wood okay. in the middle of the desert. <laughs> I, I mean, somehow, yeah. Yes. I, need to, I need to ask a question, though. Mm-hmm. Can death clothes breathe fire? Uh, no. No, no they can't. No. I don't think they, they can't, no. If they could, they that spit. would be a whole nother, whole new horrifying yeah. beast. That would be like... You'd... That would be like a literal trying dragon. To... That would be I, uncomfortable. I wonder, if they would ever... I wonder if there's a way that they could have mutated to have done that. Actually, I think I was... While reading the lore, I'm pretty sure there was... A subspecies of Deathclaw that was genetically designed to breathe fire. No, that was fire ants. Never mind. No, oh, yeah. that would be yeah. terrifying. There are the uh, God fire, fire echoes, ants though. and the Deathclaw mating to create a fire ant Deathclaw. I mean, there are fire geckos which do breathe fire in uh, they do, Vegas. Yeah. Yeah, that's, true. Yep, that's, that's, why, that's why I was confused. It's like, wait, could death claws be able to be fire? <laughs> There's or a potentiality not? they could mutate somehow, but uh, not yet, anyways. But yeah, so you you guys Hopefully take out never. some wood, start laying it down, start making a fire. Uh, I assume that both uh, Winchester and Sasuke are making the meal. Um, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Sasuke, do you let him help you? <laughs> he is bigger he, than you. He ain't touching my cooking kit. <laughs> so if he comes close to try and start touching my pots and pans i will wave my knives at him and what do i gotta roll for cooking uh it's you... survival yeah survival All right. well, and i mm -hmm. get survival plus 10 when i'm cooking with my cooking kit yeah well is that she, uh... she threatened us not to touch her stuff right oh my god we're on and yeah you gonna try and touch my shit Winchester tries to go and cook. Look, Jap Taxi has a habit of pissing off the females in his group, but I'm not breaking that streak now. <laughs> you attempt to start would cooking. I be able to... Hmm? Would I be able to roll perception to, to notice him oh, doing whatever he's about to do? You're welcome to. Winchester attempts to start cooking with like his own materials and stuff, kind of like looking at Sasaka. It's like he's he's shivering some... some, some... Oh, no. Well, no, remember, he's cooked for himself, so he's just doing what he remembered. He, he, like, you know, had provisions that he took from his cave, mm -hmm. so he pulled out mole rat meat, and he puts it over the fire, starting to cook it. This smell is horrifying. <laughs> it smells real bad. Ace, you don't notice anything because you're caught off guard by the uh, rancid smell of a mole rat being cooked. Without any prep. <laughs> what? You hear a no, start God. gagging, and it's like, oh, I know that smell. I made that mistake <laughs> one too many times. No, is that the thing. is that mole rat? <laughs> Sasuke, don't bring oh. up my failures. Oh. Oh. What the fuck did you do, oh. Winston? What the fuck, dude? So I'm cooking my my favorite meal, mole rat. God, smells delicious. You're burning your favorite meal? No, it hasn't had a chance to burn yet. When smells you look delicious. At it, it's probably on fire. <laughs> Winchester looks at it. It's burnt. See, it's just it's just 
Okay, I think it's burned. <laughs> uh, Jap, what, what are you doing? It's perfect. I'm poking her pot. She told us not to touch her pots and pans. So I'm doing the exact opposite. I'm poking each pot and pan individually. As you're attempting to get over the uh, the gut wrangling smell that you're uh, that you're smelling, <laughs> which that probably uh... smelled worse because remember his his. Uh... Yeah. Oh no, I'm I mean Sasuke. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. As uh, Krepis kind of walks over, I assume uh, Winchester that you don't want to chomp on the uh, charcoal. No, no, Winchester when he's when he heard that Krampus thought mm -hmm. it, it, it it's perfect. Mm -hmm. He literally just hands it over to him as he pulls out another one and gets ready to start cooking it. Oh, God. I, I frantically did. begin trying to stop him from cooking another one of those abominations. And, uh, Sasuke, as, as you are here, you are smelling and hearing this discourse of unpleasantness, you, you hear a very familiar jangle and jingle of dunk, dunk, Who the dunk. fuck is touching my pots? <laughs> Who the fuck is touching pot? Jaffy make go make down. I pick up my bat. <laughs> Jaffy go Jaffy make a noise. Jaffy happy. I walk over to Jap. Why? I point. I point my bat at Jap. Mm. Have you guys ever right, seen that's... a hat in time? Yeah, I know exactly no. what. You're what you're doing i know exactly what you're doing all i could no. see is this literal child from a hat in time you literally play as a child at one point you get a baseball bat <laughs> that's what happened is it, isn't it from the uh n n metro uh, yeah 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 the metro mm -hmm. and all i could see yeah, is metro. her in like a gangster outfit like pointing a freaking baseball bat at this man who has a mask on <laughs> <laughs> he's just poke 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 and every now and then Jack, it a I will off. give you three <laughs> seconds to stop touching my shit so what you're saying is I have three seconds to continue to do this before you hit me <laughs> if you continue you will be eating bat for dinner that sounds delicious <laughs> Um, nom, nom, One. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> hear Do that. I hear those? Two. Yeah. <laughs> you see Jab just pick up two of the pans and just wait for the oh, God. <laughs> You turn and you see Jab taxi taking taking two pants just going dun 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 dun. <laughs> Y'all ain't getting no sleep because of me. <laughs> <laughs> I Three. Hey, I can I grab <laughs> Sasuka? <laughs> And hold her back from murdering as Jap. Soon, as soon as I reach three and I continue to hear the pans, no, 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 I no, am no, 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 no. The count of three. Jap widens his arms and slaps them together above his head. <laughs> Tongue. Like right as I count to three. Yes. Yeah. And that's the last one. I charge at him with my bat. He's eating <laughs> bat for dinner tonight. <laughs> you said I had three seconds. Somehow, in this wasteland, nothing is hearing. <laughs> Dang. Question. Uh, Can you hit Jap? Oh, that's a good question. Probably. <laughs> I think she might have enough. Uh, roll your uh, baseball. Oh, sorry. Roll your stick. It's about the same uh, <clears throat> thing. How are you going to aim, though? <laughs> I'm just swinging for where I last heard the pots and pans. <laughs> oh, it's, it's gonna be so easy to dodge her, though. She's swinging Where I just where I heard the that. last pot and pan, I am swinging. That was above Jack's head, Ron. Think about this, Ron. <laughs> I know. I don't say. She's also two foot ten. She can't reach where the pans actually were. Yeah, but Jap oh. was squatting. <laughs> that doesn't matter. She's two foot ten. Oh, she switched. Oh, oh, uh, do do a do a minus twenty, um, Sasuke. Minus twenty. Oh. 
Yeah, because you you are legitimately blind, <laughs> and you are attempting to hit this someone true. who is now but I'm swinging in... for where I heard the noise. I'm not necessarily mm-hmm. aiming for anything; just swinging where the noise was oh, as hard true. as I can. Oh my god! Oh, you're gonna hit your own parts. Uh, critical chance. Oh my god! Yeah, roll, roll, roll your blind stick. <laughs> I, I'm trying, but I don't know. Oh, what the critical, critical chance, chance zero. Is. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> you st- god, you got a ninety-three on that roll of a one d hundred. That is as one of the worst rolls you could have gotten. <laughs> you and almost. I still only critical. managed to get a thirty-seven. Yeah. You oh, wow. swing ba 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 bada and like you swing hard for a chick <laughs> with no strength. You swing stupidly fucking hard. I mean that bat is whistling through the air. It's legitimately terrifying to most of the people in your group how hard you're swinging as it collides Can with I... your own pots. <laughs> you hit your Can... own stuff. Can I grab her from behind? In like a bear hug to <laughs> and just look at Jap and say, "Run." <laughs> See, Jap looks at you. I start wiggling, and for you see, Jap has no sense for danger. <laughs> oh, you, you are, you're gonna die. <laughs> as he her, as he starts poking her face from all sides. After, like, the third poke, I just look at you deadpan and let go of her. You can't uh, tell Jap. You're pretty sure he's laughing. After the second poke, she goes incredibly still in your arms. <laughs> oh, jeez. And then you let her go after the third poke? Just uh-huh. Does Jap continue to poke her? He's pulling you. He poked your face. As long as he was, you, you were being held, and then he stopped, and he's just staring at you now. <laughs> oh god! Hi, Jap. Yeah. Taxi. Uh huh. You are <laughs> on naughty list. Oh no! <laughs> Eyes flash. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. you, know what have, you know what my answer to that is? Come on, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't fucking care anymore. Come I on, am yes, you see, know. I am seeing red right now. You don't want to hear my answers. What the hell do oh, you yes, see? Yes, that's what I'm about to do. Run You're the fuck away? No. Why would you have run from a friend? <laughs> Grandpa but... starts walking towards me. Jap has an answer for you. Knock, knock. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Who the fuck is there? Boopa. <laughs> What'd you just say? Boopa. Boopa. Boopa who? Boopa you. As he boops your nose. <laughs> I immediately start sprinting at him from wherever he was. As as Sasuke gets booped, Ace just starts trying desperately to hold back his snickering. I start sprinting in front of me since I just got booped on the nose. So I'm assuming he's right in front of me. I start sprinting at him. You tackle All the while, Winchester's just sitting there while watching his food cook. Just hearing all this going on in the background, but just ignoring it. Just having a pleasant time watching the You're way too used to Gap. He is the This Is Fine dog. So, uh, yeah. Krampus, Krampus, just plops ne- Krampus just plops next to uh, Winchester after the cha- uh, after the the as the chasing's happening. Mm-hmm. Munching on the burnt mole rat. And he's like, my head hurts. I understand what you mean, my friend. All that yelling. Just, Gap is just like turning around her like she can't see where he is so he's slapping but he's like doing circles around her i'm going can i take my stick and do like a leg sweep 
on the ground oh around me, God. like in like in a circle. You can try. Oh my what god. What do I roll for that? Is that melee? Uh, melee you, weapon you, thing? Yeah, you just roll your weapon hey, again. Tomorrow, I'm clapping. <laughs> Also, keep in mind, Krampus is lifting his mask a little bit so he can just eat the mole rat. <laughs> Winchester oh, 66. Really oh my god, I think that actually hits. How freaking low is that? God, you got 10 on that roll. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I, I think she, she hits you in the leg. I hit you in the ankle <laughs> with my stick. <laughs> I, for some reason, my brain went to, like, she whops him in the ankle, he falls over, and she realized that she hit him, so she just keeps swapping him in the ankle. <laughs> I found his weak point, guys. I found the weak point. It's the ankles. So she just keeps bashing at his ankles. <laughs> What's your stab that? That hurt. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. Okay. Um, Everyone, what? that meat had a hurt point. Once, once she's done uh, using her stick as a beating whip on his ankle, she reaches into her little pouch that she keeps on her at all times, mm -hmm. uh, takes yeah. some um, healing salve out of it, and then <laughs> slaps it. Like, legitimately slaps it onto his ankle. No, okay, wait, before you can, you can do it. that, he grabs the wrist with the healing stuff and holds your hand up. No! How close is it to the ankle? Ah, uh, quite far. <laughs> he grabbed it. Quick. I used my other hand and grab it off the hand and put it on his ankle. No, he's grabbing both of your arms and screaming no at you. <laughs> you don't want healing salve? Nobody touches Jap with drugs. It's not... It's, it's like aloe vera. Dude. It's not even aloe vera. It's fucking Vic's vapor rub, bitch. Oh my God. It's, no, 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 no. Jap it's... understand drugs. Jap not stupid when it comes to the drugs. <laughs> do you what not want to be healed? Girl. I'm a doctor. So, so am I. <laughs> you look at Jap Taxi. <laughs> uh, you I'm actually so know. I'm so confused. How are you a doctor? <laughs> if you're a doctor, then you would know this is a healing salve and cannot be addicted to. Yes, but you can also modify healing salves to be very potent drugs. That's true. I pull out the generic jar of healing salve. Pulls out the generic jar of Vic's vapor rub. <laughs> no, it's aloe vera. Yeah, <laughs> looking it over. It is extremely normal. Okay, cap allows. I slap it onto his ankle. <laughs> Smack. You feel for the very first Would time. Would that be a unarmed attack? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you feel for the very first time his lab coat brushing against your face. <laughs> yeah, I never took it off, did I? No. <laughs> <laughs> but she can't see you, so she's. I mean, that's fair. <laughs> it's just the lab coat kind of brushes against you, and you're like, oh. I don't care. <laughs> Oh, God. Slap. I heal you for 21. I think that's more than my health. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot more, more than the damage, damage she took. Yeah. Do, I it's have, like, do I just go to my max HP? Yeah, just stay up to okay. max. Um, <laughs> so you go back to your now uh, dented bots and pants that you whacked. <laughs> oh, you... Beat your yes, own pots and pans, you poor soul. I, I don't think they're... I, I don't know anything's wrong with them. I just start cooking with them like regular. Oh, yeah, because you can't see it. I mean, you could definitely feel how hard you put it, but uh, it's not broken, so it works. Yeah. Hmm? Dude, that meme... That meme... <laughs> go look what? I go boop Winchester. <laughs> It? He just kind of, you see his eyes try to go cross as he's looking at his, as he tries to look at his nose, but it's, you know, considering <laughs> it's kind of hard for him. What? 
what are you doing? Stop that. Why? Why are you doing this? Why do people nobody like? Why do nobody like Boom? <laughs> well, it's it's not that I don't like it. It's just I I don't understand it. Why do it? Well, <laughs> oh, dear me, I I, I seem to be befuddled. Huh. <laughs> what? Boop. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he just cool. sneezes on you. <laughs> uh, I have my mask on. I sneeze in my mask. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh, god. oh. <laughs> he, he just sees some snot like leaking down his mask. Oh. <laughs> he just takes a bite of the mole rat again. Oh, Added God. flavor. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Alright, with that horribly uncomfortable thought as a... Uh... I can hear <laughs> Sin just cringing. God. I'm assuming, <laughs> Rogue, that this entire time you've just been leaning back enjoying the show. Um, uh, yeah, I finally found my, um, Christmas tin of popcorn and just <laughs> trying to go on that. Uh, it oh, just bro. has tiny just reindeer and, and like red and white uh, snowflakes on it. Uh, it's exactly. Cool. It's old yeah, shit. Pop- but... <laughs> it was shit, but it's um, cherry pop. After a while, so... Krampus just gets up, goes to a. Oh mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> he gets up and. He gets up, goes to like away from the group, wipes, cleans his mask out, and comes back oh, with it on again. God. <laughs> He's just covering his shirt now as he's walking back. <laughs> all all you shirt. hear, Sasakaya, is achoo! Wipe, wipe, wipe. Sits. I hate flavor. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I just feel a little disgusted on the inside. But I also have to deal with surgeries, so, you know. Elf girl, I'm try fine. it. It tastes wonderful. <laughs> What is he trying to hand me? He's trying to hand you a, 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 a nearly burnt roll mat. And covered in snot. Roll mat? <laughs> roll mat. Roll mat. Roll mat. A mole, mole rat. rat covered in his snot. <laughs> mole rat. You know, I would probably explain this to her. <laughs> you, you know, Krampus, I'm good. I'm just going to eat my stew that I made. <laughs> I'm assuming you hand this stew to most of your teammates. <laughs> but yeah, I just wash my face afterwards, but come back. Beautiful. Mole rat is gone. I just sit there. <laughs> oh, do, you, do you give most of your soup to, to most of the other people? Yeah, I give my soup. I, get, I, get, I give out a bowl to everybody. <clears throat> Even Jap. <laughs> Eat. I hesitantly give it to Jap. (laughs) (laughs) Did he just question my cooking? No, he questioned how he eats the cooking. There's a spoon in the bowl, you know that, right? (laughs) How am I going to get underneath the mac? Take it off. Um, that would be probably... Okay. Oh, no. Yeah. Ooh. Juan, are you going to try to stop him? <laughs> I mean, considering the last time he took it off, but... I mean, so a million things... Uh, uh, all the, all this <clears throat> goes through all goes through Winchester's mind in an instant. Oh, no, I need to stop him. They don't know what happens when he takes it off. Wait, they don't know what happens when he takes it off. It might be best for him to take it off now while he's in a controlled in a in a sort of controlled environment so they can understand why not to take his mask off. So he lets it happen. <laughs> oh yeah. He moves his mac- mask upside and puts a spoon under it and sips. This is really good. <laughs> yeah, see, told you. It's great. <laughs> he's like moving it up and down as he eats with the bowl on the ground, he's sitting crisscross on the ground and you Okay, Winchester is pleasantly surprised. He's like, okay, thank goodness nothing bad happened. What did you think? Also... the mask off. Like, completely off. 
Hmm? Winchester, we both know that's a bad idea. <laughs> yes, of course, we all know it's a very bad idea for you to take your mask off. Good idea? <laughs> no. Krampus. Depends on your perspective. But Krampus, listen, think of it this way. Taking taking off Jap's mask is like do it is like even worse than being put on the naughty list. The mega naughty list. <laughs> yes. Something pulls that X. <laughs> no Tell way. me more about this. Super bad naughty list. Oh my god. It's the place that only people who have committed the most the most mm, um, naughty horrendous of crimes. I love how Ron is not <laughs> oh, I love how Winchester is not helping Jeff's case. <laughs> He's just slowly getting his axe okay. ready to swing at him. <laughs> he, he, like Jeff, what do you put his armor and shit? Anyone that touches Jeff mask? Anyone that takes this piece of thing off my face <laughs> is on the naughty list, not Jap. Because it's they stole not something not very, very, very precious to Jap. <laughs> and that can't just go on the naughty list. That has to go on the worst the naughty list. The mega naughty list. He looks at Winchester if he approves. <laughs> Winchester just nods. Okay. And he puts the axe down. <laughs> This is the stupidest thing I've ever seen, and I love it so much. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I can't. <laughs> this is not... take, One of these days, I'm gonna make a story off. about Anyone this. Anyone tries to, I kill. Oh my god. That works for Jeff. As Jeff goes and sits back down and eats his soup slowly, as because mask lifting and keeping mask mm -hmm. on face for the most part. One of Follow. these days, I'm going to make... A, a, a fan fiction based off of this. It's going to be horrifying. <laughs> All right. Fiction off of this just general conversation. <laughs> just the entire thing you guys been going. Just your, your guys' journey through this, this game. I'm going to turn into a story <laughs> one day. Uh, God. Oh, God. It's going to be horrifying. As Saska finishes eating and mm -hmm. finishes cleaning up her mess and putting it in her roly poly bag. <laughs> um. She she immediately goes over to Ace and starts curling up underneath a blanket that she Aww. pulled out from almost nowhere and then passes the fuck out. I allow it. <laughs> and it seems like the entire world is dark and quiet and oddly enough, you guys are having a semi pleasant night. One of the first semi pleasant nights that you guys have truly had for quite some time. Probably. It may be I the fact. Trust it. I'm holding my gun in my sleep. I yeah. need to pee. <laughs> no, oh, no. Go pee. <laughs> Why would you need to I, I, mm. For most of you, it might be the safety of the Death Claw being there, but that's not very safe. It might be the safety of the Super Mutant ready to kill anything at y'all's behest. Be behest, behest, or it might be the fact that you have a warm stomach of food, and nothing's trying to kill you. But it's a decent night for most of you. Ace wants to not die today, but yeah. <laughs> what would you do with a drunken sailor? What would you do okay. with a drunken sailor? Early in the morning. <laughs> uh, that's how y'all fall asleep. <laughs> oh my. God. All right. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this. We do this every Saturday at about 7 p.m. PST. So feel free to join us if you guys are interested in watching this kind of content. If you guys want to see our previous uh, previous episodes, go over to Tables of Tartarus, our YouTube channel, which is in uh, well below. I would usually say description, but I can't seem to figure out how to do a description for uh, Twitch. And uh, we also have two other channels: Purgatory Core and Vaults of Valhalla. It's where we pull other stuff. We also have a schedule down there, so feel free to look, look at that. If you guys just want to find out when we do stuff, just follow us, and you'll see a notification popping up whenever we do a stream, which we do extremely randomly. So we'll see you guys when we see you guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Um, I'm empty. <laughs>